He was a civil rights icon, a community activist, and a Detroiter. Today, we're mourning the loss of Dr. Arthur Johnson. Action News reporter Kim Russell is live in the newsroom with a look at his legacy. Dr. Arthur Johnson will no doubt be remembered for sticking up for human rights. It's a mission he took pride in and started as a young man. In 1948, he became friends with a classmate at Morehouse College, a man named Dr. Martin Luther King, Jr. They often worked together on projects. Born in Georgia, Dr. Johnson made Detroit his home. He led the NAACP's Detroit branch in the 50s, helping it grow to 60,000 members. He then began working at Wayne State University. He retired from the university as senior vice president for university relations in 1995. The Detroit NAACP says Johnson helped students in the civil rights era and released a statement saying, quote, Dr. Johnson will always serve as a very important and transforming part of NAACP history in this community. Our prayers will continue to be with his family and we will hold his memory as a blessing to our organization. Yesterday, the 85-year-old lost his battle with Parkinson's disease. We'll let you know when funeral arrangements are released. Live in the newsroom, Kim Russell, 7 Action News.